Hi everyone and welcome back. Today I will be sharing my weekly knit galley review. So this week I just read one knit galley book. I read Set in Stone by Kimberly Woodhouse and I quite enjoyed this book. I'm going to be giving it four stars. Um, it wasn't quite a five star read for me. I did feel that at sometimes the plot was a bit slow and it does um, feature um, paleontology, which is not exactly my cup of tea. <laughs> so for kind of those reasons, um, I'm giving it four stars instead of five. And also it, it featured um, a trope that I don't like. Um, it's kind of a spoiler if I share this um, trope. So I'll just leave it at that, that it had a trope that I find annoying and I don't really like it in my books. Um, so yeah, I'm giving it four stars. This book follows two uh, adults as they um, work on dinosaur digs. So there is um, a competition that is going on and um, the, the first team to um, like uncover their dinosaur the quickest gets to have it um, displayed in the museum. So there's that going on. That's kind of the main focus. And, you know, the, the male love interest is on one side and the female love interest is on the other. And then they do meet and come together. Um, but yeah, I just kind of found um, that it could have been a lot more interesting for me. Um, but I really did enjoy it. Like, I mean, I'm still giving it four stars. Um, and yeah, so uh, if you want a Christian fiction, historical fiction um, book that has to do with dinosaur bones and fossils, um, maybe it's more for you. But I just feel like there wasn't too much even to talk about now because that was like pretty much the main, the main um, storyline, the main plot was just them digging. I mean, there are some like sub um, plots a bit, but it was just okay for me. Um, but I will be trying other books by this author and hopefully I enjoy them. So that is the only book that I have to talk about for this week. Um, hopefully next week I will have another book for you guys to hear about. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!